Hi, this is Colin Horner of Visual Thinking with another in the series, Making the Most of Mind Manager. In this short video tutorial, I'm going to show you how with the latest version of Mind Manager, 2017, we can publish content from a mind map into an HTML format and our reader can navigate it through a web browser exactly as if it's a mind map but he obviously doesn't have Mind Manager installed on his machine. It'll give me the opportunity also of showing you one of the latest features in the Map for Mind Manager Productivity add-in which enables this process. So for the purpose of the demonstration I'm going to open up from another add-in, Results Manager, the help file. And not surprisingly we find the help file is in mind map format with notes and links to other maps and further links. So a whole family of maps with a help file, tutorials, etc, etc. If I close these submaps and go back to the original and show you now Mind Manager 2017 export to HTML format, choose a location, desktop, choose a name, overwrite a previous export, and in quick, quick time, this is exported to an HTML format. If we now go to a web browser, Chrome, and I open that file. I'm now viewing this help file through a web browser, but it looks identical to if I was in a Mind Manager interface. Open notes, etc. However, obviously the hyperlinked files still reside on my desktop, so I can't access them through this web browser. But if we close that down and we return to our Mind Manager map, fortunately, as I say, with the latest version of map, Nigel Galt has added a capability, he's called it Linked Map Rollup, where we execute this function, um, we accept a proviso, it won't perform this function if there are what we call reciprocal hyperlinks, but I know there's not, so I accept that. And now Map for Mind Manager interrogates this whole family and converts hyperlinks to attachments. So it takes a copy of the hyperlinked file and temporarily attaches it to the core map. It will then return through the family of maps and remove those attachments from the submaps. So our submaps return to their original state. It's ready now. So now I go to the export function again, choose the HTML format, overwrite the original export. So now let's go back to our web browser Chrome, <clears throat> open up the same file again and here we now see, here's the original map, let's increase the view a bit um, and open up one of the legs, but now you can see there's the hyperlink, but now we've got an attachment, so I can execute the attachment and there's the sub map and the further sub maps are also attached. So here we have a very elegant way of publishing content, procedure manuals, policy documents, help files, etc. in a format where people can navigate and look at them as if they were looking navigating in a in mind manager. We can <coughs> navigate back through the structure. So that is export to HTML, publishing content 
which your reader can access through a web browser, but using a very elegant little add-in to convert hyperlinked maps into temporarily attached maps through Map for Mind Manager. So this is Colin Horner at Visual Thinking. Thank you for listening.